governments might try to make laws in order to make it illegal to purchase certain goods and products. But what they don't know isn't going to hurt them, right? Rare objects might be a little bit more difficult to obtain, which will certainly add to their price once they find a potential buyer. Whether they're rare antiquities acquired from looting museums, to certain types of cells which can actually make you look younger, here are rare things sold on the black market. But first, we asked you guys in our most insane private jets video which private jet you'd rather have, Air Force One, Trump Force One, or Vlad Force One. We think Killer Wolf has the right answer here, so we'll go ahead and give him a shout out in today's video. Let us know in the comments section if you think any of these black market items deserve to be legal or why you think they should remain illegal and maybe we'll feature you in an upcoming video. Number 13. Aztec Antiquities People who are able to steal artifacts from a lost civilization are really stealing more than just something with monetary value. They're stealing knowledge that just simply can't be replaced. In Mexico City in 1985, 140 of the most valuable Aztec, Mayan, and other pre-Columbian artifacts were stolen from the National Museum of Anthropology in Mexico on Christmas Eve. This was not a holly jolly Christmas morning for anthropologists. It seems clear that crooks study their history for all the wrong reasons. This was the largest heist on pre-Columbian artifacts ever. Many of the artifacts were made from valuable raw materials like gold or jade. This photo here shows Bacall's burial mask made of jade to give you an idea of what was robbed here. Officials couldn't really put an exact number on how much the heist was worth because of how unique and historically important the items were. Some estimate as much as $32 million, but who knows how much they could have sold for on the black market. Somehow the objects were recovered, but Aztec antiquities are some of the most highly sought after on the black market. Number 12. Counterfeit Cash Many of us have been short on cash at times and kind of wish we could just print it out at home instead of having to go to work. But that's against the law. Although the government has made steps in recent years to make our cash less vulnerable to counterfeiters, we still come across some problems sometimes. The country of Peru seems to be one of the biggest leaders of this practice, and in 2012, a raid took place in the capital city of Lima where police found $2 million in phony cash and 1.5 million euros. This is just a very small fraction of how much this country has made. The laws for committing this crime in South America are just a slap on the wrist, with culprits only getting a warning for their first time and the second time only having to spend a few nights in jail. Number 11. Bear Paws It's not just drugs custom and police are seizing. The wildlife black market is booming as well. The Bear Paw Soup has been a delicacy since China's Shang Dynasty and was made popular by one king named Zhao. In 2013, Chinese officials caught two Russian men attempting to bring 213 severed bear paws into China along the Mongolian border. Once bear paws cross the border, their value increases 10 times since it's used in the controversial soup. Bear paws can fetch a price of about $1,000 each in some cases. They can even be resold to be worth about $2,000, making this business very lucrative. The demand for this has skyrocketed in recent years, and many believe this could lead to the black bear becoming endangered in parts of Asia. Number 10. Sea Cucumbers Sea cucumbers aren't cucumbers at all, and in fact, they're actually bottom-dwelling creatures somewhat similar to sea urchins or starfish. The demand for sea cucumbers is rising, but people aren't supposed to eat these because they play a vital role in keeping coral reefs alive. This has gotten to be such a problem that even Mexico is getting involved with the shipping sea cucumbers into China. Although they probably don't look like something you want to eat, sea cucumber is said to not only taste good, but be very nutritious, helping reduce the chance of gaining heart disease. It's also high in protein and helps with bone density. All those benefits would come at a high price, of course. One kilogram of sea cucumber can fetch a price anywhere from $435 to $1,000 plus. Just use your chopsticks carefully because these things can get slippery. Number 9. Devil's Breath Also known as the zombie drug, it's going to take some serious connection to get a hold of this stuff. Some have considered it to be the scariest drug out there, not from the trippy hallucinations, but from the lack of self-control. It's not a drug that you would use for any kind of pleasurable experience, but mainly use against targets of crime. It can take the form of a dust, which is then blown into someone's face before it takes effect. It gets instantly absorbed in the skin, it's completely odorless and colorless, and you won't even remember anything after it hits you. Its more scientific name is scopolamine. There are quite a few myths that exist about Devil's Breath, and some might even believe that it just knocks you out as opposed to turning you into a zombie. It's mainly available in South America in countries like Colombia and Brazil. Number 8. Japanese Flight Attendant Uniforms If you're in the black market for one of these, you might have some serious issues or need to find a date sometime soon. 
flight attendants in Japan have been fetishized to the point where their uniforms can sell for big bucks. The ones with the panties included can probably fetch a higher price. Japan Airlines have told their staff not to sell their flight uniforms, especially from old stewardesses who were laid off. Online prices for these uniforms went out of control when Japan Airlines went bankrupt and had to fire people. Since they're not really supposed to be sold and it's in demand, people are going to find a way to sell them. A simple jacket can sell for about $3,000, while the whole shebang should be sold for about a good 5000 bucks. Japan Airlines has been looking to prosecute those who stole their outfits. Number 7. Pangolins While rhino horns and tusks seem to certainly pick up the big bucks for illegal wildlife traffickers, the dwindling numbers of these animals make it tough to sell in large quantities. It might come to a surprise, but in fact pythons appear to be the most commonly smuggled live animal that are sold as pets. Exotic birds, fish, turtles also rank high on the list. Illegal meat is another common commodity, especially from shark fins and also pangolins. You've probably never heard of this mammal before, but it actually has scales. It's extremely rare and also used for traditional medicine. The scales are boiled off their bodies and their blood is seen as some kind of magical healing potion. Many actually claim this to be the most hunted animal. Something needs to be done before it's completely wiped off the face of the planet. Number 6. Mesopotamian Artifacts At one point, the Baghdad Museum was chock full of important artifacts from Mesopotamia until the Gulf War broke out. It was considered to be among the top museums of its kind and had a fine collection of antiquities, some from the first civilizations of the world. It included works from the Babylonians, Sumerians, Assyrians, and Akkadian cultures. All kinds of chaos took place in 2003 and the Warka vase was forcibly snagged from its protective case. Made of carved alabaster stone and found in the Sumerian temple complex dedicated to the goddess Inanna, it was first discovered in 1933. Thousands of years old, it was one of the most precious items in the museum and it was found broken in 14 pieces after thieves tried to take off with it. Although some of the artwork was either returned or managed to escape the looting, roughly 10,000 smaller objects were stolen and likely sold in the black market. Number 5. Zamzam Water Considered to be the holiest water on the face of the planet to Muslims, Zamzam Water comes from a well near Mecca that was excavated by hand about 100 feet deep. The well is often visited by pilgrims, and some can take this water and then sell it on the black market. Since population in this area has increased, water from the well is starting to decrease which means more people are willing to spend more and more money on it. Many will never get the chance to make it all the way to Mecca, so the stuff is in high demand. The British Food Standards Agency reported a warning to those who were drinking it, saying that it was contaminated with arsenic and contained high levels of bacteria. The Saudi Arabian government also strictly forbids the resale of Zamzam water, which means the only other place to get it is on the black market. Number 4. Bladder Soup Chinese herbal medicine usually calls for some unconventional ingredients. Border officials were a little bit surprised when they found swim bladders of the coveted Toto Aba McDonald fish. These large fish are considered to be heavily poached for their meat and organs, especially the bladder, which is worth a pretty penny. 200 bladders once sold for $3.6 million in 2013. It supposedly cures infertility but also aids with skin and circulatory problems as well. Number 3. Moon Rocks if somehow you can go to the moon, harvest some moon rocks, and bring them back to Earth, you'll likely be extremely rich. Despite the expense of getting there, with moon rocks selling at $50,000 per gram, you wouldn't need to bring back much to at least break even. Astronauts didn't bring back much with them after the Apollo mission, possibly hoping to keep the price pretty high. There's an estimated toll of 842 pounds of moon rock on display and it has even been considered a national gift. The astronauts who recover the material are not allowed to keep any personal supply. Moon rock is so expensive on the black market that even people working at NASA space stations have been caught trying to sell it. One woman got caught trying to sell $1.7 million worth of the substance to authorities and was charged with a federal crime. Number 2. Stem Cells The interest in stem cells which comes from embryos has always been a controversial topic and harvesting and selling them is a serious felony. But that hasn't stopped a lot of people from trying to get rich anyways. One of the main reasons they want them so bad is because they can be used in cosmetic surgery in order to make someone look younger and improve skin quality. They can also be used to enhance the quality of a joint, but typically since stem cells come from unborn fetuses, there are going to be some shady ways to go about getting them. Not only was Planned Parenthood accused of being a part of this grim underworld, an undercover video gave an unbelievable insight on the trade that's a little bit too much to go into on YouTube. One case in Hungary though, clients paid $25,000 for a treatment of this stuff, so it had to have been good. Number 1. Beatles a man from Australia was busted when Customs seized some cringeworthy contraband. Here in these photos, you see dozens of the estimated 1,300 tiger beetles placed in luggage that were seized by officials in Australia. 
They apparently try to conceal them in empty yogurt containers, but as you can tell, this might have looked a little bit suspicious. The two behind the operation were detained at the Perth International Airport. Good things Customs did their job, or the US might have had some creepy crawlers from Australia like this. So which one did you think was the most interesting? Let us know in the comments section, and we'll see you next time.